from from my email to the email I want to send the subject will be hello world and my message I say this is a fun email and let's click send and the mail should be sent let me check the console and it says sent email it means the message has been sent let's check my email address and here we go I have received an email address uh, sorry an email let's open there's my subject and my email hey dear friends welcome to this video in the last video you have learned how to send an email address by using the node chase and this is what we got we received the email address but as I promised in this video we're gonna learn how to make a form so you can write the reception email address the subject and by pressing a button you send an email and instead of doing that in, in the code in using terminal how we can do that let's create a file I call it index.js okay inside this index.js I will write my application but before that in this tutorial in this application we use express so first go to npm js.com and search for express and this is the express you have to copy this line of code and beam i express and come back to your visual code go to the new terminal open a terminal and paste and present them to install the express inside your application so we have installed the express clear after that we have to use one more library which is pat okay the node.js pat module let's open it and copy this line of code and just like we did for the express paste and click press enter and it takes a few seconds to install and this is installed successfully close the terminal and now let's write the code now I wanna use the express so make a variable I call it express and this is equal to require and I wanna require the express okay after the express I wanna use the HTTP module require if you don't know what is HTTP you have to watch my tutorial about it before watching this video okay and I also want to use the path require and path after the path I also want to include the node mailer which is the most important in this case so require node mailer after we have imported our modules I make a variable I call it app and this app uses the X okay what's wrong this used Express <sighs> okay what I want after that I'll make another variable and this will be the server okay I use HTTP dot server and inside this one I put app so my HTTP server uses the express after that I make a variable called called port and I was on to use the port 500 after that I use my app I wanna set the first thing I wanna set is the port port and I set this one to the port this one after that I wanna I use my app and this time I say use use what I want the app to use the express dot JSON so this will use the JSON after that I ask my app to use use what from the express I want to use URL encoded and inside this URL encoded I want to extend I want to use the extent so how are we going to do this put it as object and say extend it extend it and set this one to true once you have done that one again I say my app to use express dot from express use static and I want to use the static for my path so use the path and from the path I want to use join 
and from the join I have to use a um, pad string and I want to use the directory okay so to slash something like this in direct name and after that I put a comma and this will be the string itself so what is that okay this will be my page name okay page slash index.html so what it basically does it loads it loads a file for me by using express.json and it also encode that one and use the path to join that one so it open a file inside of an, a folder and put it inside the index so let's create a folder I call it page inside this page I make another file I call it index.html h1 hello okay html look okay, at it let's rename it to index.html so my application will load this file whenever it's loaded okay after that what I want I wanna make the routing how you can do the routing it's very easy I use my app and ask to get get what get everything from the root directory the main root directory and run a function which has a request and a response and inside this function I want to respond I use the respond and what I want I want to send file I want to send a file and which file I want to send use the path library and ask for join and I want to join what this line of code just copy that one and paste it in here and that's it for the routing okay let's test if it works but before doing that let's make my form so this will be a form where I can put the email reception the subject and a, a button that gonna send email for me so I make the basic HTML5 structure I give it a title email sender and inside the body what I want to do is I make a form and I give it an action this is the action which later we use it inside our index.js and this will be sent email whenever the button is pressed it runs this it does this action I also want to make a method for this one and this will be post okay and inside my form I have few things I make a label and this will be for ML and I call it from and after that I make an input and this input will be ML I give the name from I also gave it an ID from I just copy this one and paste it one more time and maybe two time okay the second one is two I change from for two the type is ML the name is two and the ID is also two after that I have the subject so this will be subject subject copy this put it in the name and put it into the ID I change the type to ticks and after that I make another label I call it message message and for this one I don't use the input but I use text area and I give an ID of message I also give it name of message and close my text area and after that I make a button and put type will be submit this is a submit button I give the value sent and that's enough let's save this one and come back to my index.djs 
Okay. Now, what I want to do is to make another another thing. Okay, but before doing to make this, we should make the functionality that could send email. But before doing that, let me make the any shellize web server part and this will be I use my server and from server I want to listen to port and this has a function and inside this function I want to say console.log starting server on port port okay and now let me open my terminal and run this index.js okay let's open the browser and paste go to this URL and there we go so what our code does so what our code does our code will load this page whenever we open the main directory and it responds to that one and open my index.html which is located inside the page folder but at the moment it doesn't have any functionality you see when we click the submit button it go to this send email but it doesn't do anything now let's give it a functionality for doing that I make I want to use my app and say in, in this case it will be post what is it, it it means uh, whenever we click the button it posts something so you want to get the detail and do a response to it okay so where this post came from if we saw we click send it runs this URL come back to my app dot post and in here I say I give that URL so whenever a post came from here what you do comma run a function and this function have a request and a response let's open the function if you remember mm, the last video we have created I have to send the label by knowing node.js in this case this, this, we use the same thing but before doing that I want to receive the values from these inputs I want to receive these values the values which are inside my HTML file I want to receive these values how we can receive them I give them all a name so in here make a variable the first one is from I use the request dot body what it does it gives the value of anything inside the HTML we have but it use the name of that element so the first one is from so say dot from so the value of this from text input will be stored in my from variable after that I make another variable this is the 2 I want to get the value of 2 which is the same and we do that one more time for the subject from request body and this is subject and the last one is the message itself request.body message so we have the value of each of them now we can use our mailing system to send this email the first thing is we have make the transporter and this transporter is equal to node mailer and from node mailer we want to create a transport and inside this one we create we tell the node mailer which service we want to use so the service I want to use is gmail comma then the authentication this is an object which has to value the user which is the email from which email you want to send from and this is the email I want to send from the comma the second one is the password and this is not the password of your email address but this is a password which you create by going to your Google account and search for password a password 
and then here you log into your account and here you create that password if you saw my last video we have done that one okay let's paste the password which we created this is not your email address password okay 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 and what we need to do after this one okay we should put a comma in here okay after we have created this on portal we have to make the mail option so make another variable I call this one mail options and this is equal to an object and inside this object we have from from where from the variable of from comma to to who you want to send which come from my HTML file and that's two and comma subject which is also the variable subject which come from my HTML file and the last thing is text okay text and this one is equal to the message okay we created the options and the final thing is to use the transporter and ask send mail and this one have your parameter the first one is the mail options comma a function and this function have two parameter error and info and inside this function you want to check if there is any error what to do make a console console dot lock and print the error if there is no error else console dot lock and email sent with the info dot response I want to take the response of this info parameter and print that one and if that's done I want to go back to the main page so I use response dot redirect and go to the home page let's save this one and run my server again and if I go back and refresh now I say from from my email to the email I want to send the subject will be hello world and my message I say this is a fun email and let's click send and the mail should be sent let me check the console and it says send email it means the message has been sent let's check my email address and here we go I have received an email address uh, sorry an email if let's open there is my subject and my email so now you learn how to make a form to send an email by using Node.js I hope you guys learned something from this video if you have any question let me know in the comment below and if you like this video make sure to like subscribe and press the bell icon have a great time